The Clinton High School softball team played on their new field for the first time last season. But that doesn't mean the work is finished. 10 News Anderson County reporter Emily Crabtree is here in the studio and Emily this complex has been a long time coming for the team hasn't it? Yeah, Robin, it really has. The Lady Dragons have been waiting on this softball complex for almost two years. After a legal battle and lots of waiting, the school is up to bat for their new complex. Knowing what impact the, the sport had for my wife and her friends then and where it's at now, having your own field on campus is huge for our school. The Clinton High School softball team has had a few setbacks on their new complex. Now they're getting back into the swing of things. I think uh, Dr. Parrott feels confident it, sh it should get done before the season starts. After a legal battle and a complete redo of the field. It, it needed to be uh, moved back a little bit towards the school, I guess. And uh, I think the neighbor had some concerns with the lights and things, so they've addressed all those issues. And the cost of building going up. The prices. It definitely increased, uh, especially after all the COVID and stuff, all the pricing of the materials and everything has gone up. The team finally has a field to play on. A concession stand and a locker room still needs to be built, but the hope is that the players past and present can enjoy the complex. And if you want to help the team out, we will have that information on our website. Robin. Emily, thanks for sharing.